you your weekday cup of the word here on this Friday morning. We're going to look at Job chapter 27. Now Job is in his final discourse to his friends, his final confrontation with them. And in this chapter, he's, uh, he's building a mountain what he's already said. He's going to continue to affirm God's power, but he's also going to say God with that power has made my life bitter. He's made it hard. He's brought tears to my eyes. He's made everything suffering and pain and difficulty. And then in verse 7, he's going to affirm the idea that he does know. Job, Job's not a fool. He does know that if you live a godless life, it turns out bad. He, he's going to back that up. Yeah, I understand. I understand what you guys have been saying, that the wicked, the long-term effects of living a wicked life is bad things. It, bad things for your kids, and bad things for your finances, and bad things for your future, and certainly bad things when you die. I understand all of that. So this chapter, he's going to primarily focus on saying, yeah, I get that bad people die. But he's going to use that, we have to remember, as a building block for later arguments, saying, I, I understand bad people die and bad things happen to bad people, but my argument is why are bad things happening to me? Why am I going through this? I'm not a bad person. God's got all this power and he's, using it to make me bitter? He's using it to make my life hard? What about all of them out there? Isn't there enough for them? So that's your daily cup, and we'll see you next week. <music>